Who needs nut, bolt, and washer castings when you have a laser cutter? Here's a half a millimeter hexagonal bolt head. Here is a, meter, a millimeter and a half washer. Using a uh, airbrush needle to dip on glue. Yeah, a little heavy handed with it, but that's okay. It'll round out and look like steel once I paint it. So it'll work just fine. So I'm taking my X-Acto blade and pushing these on the glue. This is just carpenter's glue. There it is, there's the washers. I dab a little bit of glue on the washers. Pick up the little mini, mini, mini hexagonal pieces. Drop them on the glue. There we go. Sometimes that little bit of glue, they stick better than other times. Sometimes better than other times. Here we go, and there it is. And you can see what the final thing looks like right here. Check that out. See it? Now all we have to do is paint it. Once that glue's dried, you can see the construction paper washers here. Brown construction paper. I touch it with a little bit of ammo rust tracks. That's a MiG-0034. It's kind of, kind of like a dark terracotta. Just hit each one of these, and they don't even have to be hit evenly. And that's just going to give me a little bit of base for my next color. When that paint's dried, like with this piece here, I get my... I love this stuff. This is... Pan pastel, pan pastel Red Iron Oxide Extra Dark. It's got that beautiful little purple in it that you see in Old Rust. And a little bit of alcohol. And I, all I do is I just mix it up, make a paint, just enough to get on the brush. And just dab each little, each little laser cut and BW casting. Even if it bleeds out a little bit, it is totally fine. Seriously, it's that easy. So no more NBW castings to buy. I'll just cut them out of construction paper.